Uh, we're gonna cook up some bacon, and of course we got our visitors, the pugs, right now. Hey, troll. You ready for some bacon? Huh? What we'll also do is, uh, once we get the bacon cooked up, we'll put uh, some of the bannock right in there, do a mixture, and we'll pan fry a couple pieces of all that bacon grease. It's going to be really good. Make the puggies happy too. Is that your bacon goblin? No. I know you think it's your bacon. splinters off of it. That way you're not eating them. That's why. Um, other way is we got a piece of uh, a juniper, took the bark off, and uh, I'm going to clean out the knots with some of the dirt that's in there and get this as clean as we can. And uh, once we make the uh, bannock bread, the uh, not bannock. It's just I, I don't know why it's called bannock bread. To tell you the truth, but once you make the uh, the dough, you use the dough and you will kind of make a snake out of it and twist it around your stick. Your stick is then leaned in next to the coals, and you just rotate it around and cook it with the flat piece. You put your bread, just kind of stick it to there, and it cooks that way, facing the uh, facing the coals. Okay. So, we're going to start making the, uh, the bread. Okay, we're making bannock bread. I guess it's called that because of, uh, you cook it on a bannock board. And, uh, against the fire, we're going to use a stick and wrap the dough around the stick. Um, what we've basically got is just, uh, this quick bread mix, drop biscuit mix. Um, there's some plenty of recipes out there too, but what we're doing is we're putting in one of the bowls, we're mixing a little bit with uh, the water, let me see the consistency we got. Okay, let's put a little bit more water in there. And uh, we mix it up so it's a halfway decent dough. You don't want it too gooey, and you don't want it too wet or too dry. 
Uh, you want it like the consistency of like Play-Doh. And uh, once she gets this all mixed up, go ahead and show the camera. Yep, that's a little too wet. Um, we will get this wrapped around uh, the stick and uh, the board. All right. She's making little like pancakes. And what we do is we push them on the board so they stick a bit. It's kind of a flat bread, I guess. Don't, you know, don't press them into the board too much, but there you go. Another little piece there. Waiting patiently. Troll. Now I'm just gonna show you how to wrap the uh, wrap the stick there. Hold on. She's not gonna take the uh, dough and wrap it around the stick. Can I get it on there so it, it stays real good? Uh, watch me. Quick, so there. All right. So, fire's kind of going crazy here, but what you do is you lean it. Ooh, that's hot. You know what? I'm gonna come back in a second. Okay, what we do now is the heat that's about one, two, probably about 300 degrees. And uh, we'll watch the uh, bannock board one. And then we will rotate, them. rotate that one there. You can actually see the steam coming off of it when I was being cooked. Okay, that's it. Fastest. How's that looking? Stocking being cooked. Probably a few more minutes on that. In the meantime, what we're going to do is we're going to take the bacon grease and cut ourselves up an egg. You scrabble? Mm, sure. Everything kind of ready here. She's going to take off the uh, bread and drop it in the egg plate there. Oh, here we go. Alright, grab those and 
slide them off. <laughs> they cooked. Cooked pretty good, huh? Yeah. Let me see the inside. Yeah, okay, so you got a biscuit. Let me see the back side of the board. Yeah. Almost cooked on it. They're cooked on it. I mean, in all actuality, if that's all you have is a, a board and a stick, well, that's what's going to happen. Can you show the camera? If not, that's why we bring pans to cook in. How's it taste? Done? Mm -hmm. Hot. Mm -hmm. Let me have a waiting puggies there. You drop them down the board there and then you clean them up. Oh, they're in a fight. Mm -hmm. yeah. oh. This one here is a little piece of bacon. Hey, right, we're gonna dig in and enjoy our, our lunch now. And uh, get some hot water and clean up the mess. God, they're loud. The one that was on the stick is a little underdone, but I just got impatient. Eggs came out great. Bacon. I mean, it's hard to screw up bacon. Things came out great. There you go. Okay. Is that good bacon? Mm -hmm. how, was, how was that, huh? Is that good nummies? Mm -hmm. Yeah, we just got to scour it a little bit. I think they did a good job. <laughs> Wait, cleanup's done.